Hello, Facebook friends. It's Carla, your online doctor, with today's Live in 5. Today is Wednesday, July 31st at 5.03 p.m. And yes, I'm wearing my Coca-Cola shirt. No, I don't drink Coca-Cola. I don't even approve of Coca-Cola, but I love the logo. So there you have it. Anyway, hope my daughter's just coming in. I see her driving, so hopefully she doesn't interrupt my live by calling up the stairs. Hey Marty, hey Mary Lynn, thank you guys for watching. Okay, so yesterday and the day before we talked a lot about eye health. We talked about zeaxanthin and lutein and the benefits of supplementing with a supplement like the one I use called Illuminize. Today I actually saw a commercial on television for almost the same type of thing. Of course I know it's all synthetic because it's from a pharmaceutical company. What can I tell you? I go for the natural version. Works for me. Hello, Yuki. Thank you for watching, dear. Okay, so today we are talking about naturally occurring phenolic compound called hydroxytyrosol, which is found in olives. Okay, olives are a staple in a Mediterranean diet. People in regions of the Mediterranean are known to have better cardiovascular health due to the healthy fats in olives and olive oil. Okay, who doesn't love olive oil? I mean, I do, I think it's awesome. When my husband and I went to Spain, loved the olive oil. I mean, everything just tasted better. Okay, so when olive oil is made, it is basically cold pressed, meaning the oil is squeezed out of the fruit. Okay, olive oil, olives are considered a fruit. As far as hydroxytyrosol, most is in the pulp. So the oil has other benefits, but it would, it, I mean, it's in the oil as well, the hydroxytyrosol, but it would take a lot of oil to get benefits from this compound alone, okay? So don't stop eating your olive oil because it has tons of other benefits, the omega fats and all of that, but hydroxytyrosol is the conversation for today. So it's a powerful antioxidant, which as you know, helps fight against the damage of oxidative stress and preventing free radical damage to our cells. Okay, free radicals damage our cells and can cause uh, d damage to our DNA, can lead to all kinds of havoc in the cell. It also, hydroxytyrosol, has anti-inflammatory and cancer preventive properties. Okay, so it's a really good substance to have included in your regimen. Now, hydroxytyrosol has a unique structure since it has a fat-soluble end and a water-soluble end, giving it the ability to penetrate cell membranes for easy absorption into the body and into the cell, which is where you need these things to be, okay? But because it's water-soluble, it's also easily eliminated by the body in your urine, for example, so there's no risk of accumulating it in your body. Okay, so you have a win-win on both sides, gets in easy, gets out easy. Okay, so once in the cell, it starts scavenging free radicals. That means kind of eating them up, scooping them up, if you remember Pac-Man type of thing. Hello, Susanna. Okay, and reduces inflammation in the cell. Oxidative stress within our arteries is believed to be one of the causes of atherosclerosis. Hydroxytyrosol increases enzymes and protein levels in the cell which regulate the body's antioxidant defense system to decrease free radicals inside our arteries. This is good. Oxidized LDL cholesterol, meaning again, the same phenomenon of oxida oxygen damaging the LDL. Can't avoid oxygen, we need it. Okay, well, we can avoid oxidative stress. So the oxidative, um, oxidized LDL cholesterol is what results when LDL is damaged by free radicals. Hydroxytyrosol protects LDL from the process. Without it, LDL breakdown occurs and it leads to atherosclerosis. So you want to prevent this from happening. Hello, Marta. So hydroxytyrosol prevents platelets from clumping together, okay, especially when there's no injury in anywhere, no reason for your platelets to be clumping. And so therefore you're preventing clot formation when it's not necessary and the clot formation when it's abnormal is what is one of the things that can cause um, a, a problem in your blood vessels and decrease blood supply okay which can lead to a stroke or a heart attack again something you do not 
want to have. Now, hydroxytyrosol is the most potent anti-inflammatory compound among polyphenols, among the polyphenols in olive oil. So it's the most uh, bang for your buck of the ones in there. It inhibits the pro-inflammatory cytokines and enzymes. Now, what about cancer? You heard me mention that. Scientists estimate 75 to 90% of cancers can be prevented through lifestyle changes, okay, including proper nutrition. You've heard me talk about that. Most cancers are not genetically induced. They're environmentally induced, so proper nutrition is big. Over the past 20 years, many studies have indicated an inverse relationship between fruit and veggie consumption and the development of various cancers. The higher the fruit and veggie con consumption, the lower the cancer risk. Now, it's largely due to the polyphenols in the food. Now, hydroxytyrosol tyrosol prevents DNA damage induced by gen genotoxic molecules, as well as decreasing proliferation of cancer cells and inducing apoptosis, which is cell death, of these tumor cells. Good, good, and good, okay? So all of those things because of hydroxytyrosol. So again, if you're forgetting everything I say, remember, yes, you want hydroxytyrosol, yes, you want olive oil, and you will be fine. Now, metabolic benefits of hydroxytyrosol, it improves your lipid profile, your blood glucose levels, and your insulin sensitivity, which decreases your risk of cardiovascular disease, type 2 diabetes, hypertension, and obesity. I mean, go figure, all from olive oil, right? Well, that's what the Medita Mediterranean diet is all about. Now, continue to use your olive oil, like I said, when you're cooking, if you're making salads and you want to make a nice healthy salad dressing, etc. But you can only take so much without getting too many calories, of course, because it's caloric. But I take a supplement called Olive Essentials. And here it is, if you can see it without a glare. I'm going to see if I can... There it is, okay? Olive Essentials, okay? It's... um. Basically, one capsule of this is equal to the antioxidant fighting power of one liter of olive oil or one liter of the um, hydro hydroxytyrosol power. That is huge. Now, I continue to cook with my olive oil. I do put it on salads. I use it for all different kinds of pur for purposes when I'm cooking, but I take this for the benefits of the hydroxytyrosol and it is wonderful. So just giving you guys some supplement information that you may not have heard before. I think this one is pretty benign, but again, if you want more information about it, message me. I'll be happy to send you information and tell you how you can get any of the supplements I'm talking about. Hey, Paul, thanks for watching. Um, but as always, it's your choice. You can discuss it with your doctor. But eating healthy, living a healthy lifestyle is the first step. Now, tomorrow and Friday, and probably into next week, we're going to be talking about CBD. It is all the rage, and I have the scoop on what it's all about, what's the best to get, how much to use, the safety, yada, yada. It's all coming to you tomorrow, Friday, and I'm thinking at least Monday. So stay tuned for that. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. And I look forward to seeing you tomorrow for another Live in 5.